Decades ago, this was one of the most important steelworks plants in Argentina. Today, the rusty buildings and crumbling cooling tower are the backdrop for a facility that could shape one of the industries of the future. This university research center in northern Argentina opened last August. Its mission to develop new technology for the lithium mining industry. Near this university, large quantities of the metal are located under vast salt flats. Lithium is used in batteries and will be a vital part of the future electric car market. This region of Argentina, together with northern Chile and southern Bolivia, forms part of the Lithium Triangle. After seven years of postdoctoral research abroad, Victoria Flexer returned to Argentina to run this centre. She mentors more than a dozen students working here. Unfortunately, the areas where lithium is found uh, in, in, in the three countries are uh, the, usually the poorest areas of the countries. And uh, there's a lot of unemployment and uh, uh, there's a lack of uh, highly qualified human resources. There are currently only two companies extracting lithium in Argentina, and Flexa says most top jobs in mining industries go to foreigners. But as this industry is set to grow, she hopes the trend will reverse. We want uh, our people to be able to get not only the low jobs in, in the local market, but we also want them to get the best jobs. Recycling the millions of tonnes of lithium used in car batteries will be at the heart of the future lithium economy, says one of the world's leading authorities on lithium batteries. Dr. Doran Albach believes this centre offers Argentina a unique opportunity. The country is going to um, promote, uh, let's say, lithium-related or lithium-related science, um, and, and I believe that this place can develop unique IPs, integral properties, yeah, to recycling and, 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 and um, extracting lithium. In Argentina, Bolivia and Chile, there is excitement at the prospect of a lithium boom. Each country is approaching how they use their resource very differently, but all three are looking to add value to the raw material. The science community hopes many more students will join this first generation of researchers in Jujuy in Argentina. We look forward to getting people interested in lithium all over the world to come to Jujuy, where not only the lithium resource is, but also the knowledge will be. The goal is that this centre becomes a hub for innovation, as well as a catalyst for the lithium boom that benefits the local population here in the Lithium Triangle. Joel Richards, CGTN.